If your app is available in a variety of countries and you want to show the homepage of the app in different languages according to their base audience depending on the country they are in, you can do that easily using the App Maker dashboard in the in-app page. One great thing about in-app page is that you can add as many in-app pages as you want and you can also put them in according to the language. By default, if you have added no other language to your app, it will stay in English and this is how it will be shown in the app. But if you have added a variety of languages, say for example, I have added Arabic, English and Spanish here, you can add those in app pages as well. To add an app page, all you have to do is go to update app and then choose the language that you want to show in your app. So go to the language tab, add any language that you want. Say for example, I put in French and then click on submit. When I click on submit, this language will be added to my app. When you go back to your dashboard, you will, you will be able to see all the languages that you have added in the app. So go to customize app where you'll be able to see all the in-app pages. And then when you click on language, you'll see the languages that you have added. Now, each of these languages will be totally blank because you have to add them to your in-app page in the language that you have chosen. From here, click on add blog and keep adding banners, grids, or whatever widgets that you want in your app and then put in the language. So if it is Arabic, type in all the Arabic languages that you put in. Say, for example, I type in this and choose an action for a product. This will be saved in your Arabic language. So in the app, your users can switch languages according to the language that they need. And then the in-app page for that language will be available to their screens. Once done, just click on save and the in-app page will be saved. Click your own and make your own in-app page according to the language that you need.